Welcome back everybody to Back Kerm the Unknown and today we have another Power Ranger unboxing that I am so excited to show you. It is the Gold Rangers Power Staff. Let's take a closer look. All right guys, so today we have the Gold Rangers Power Staff. So the Gold Ranger was played by the original Red Ranger actor, Austin St. John, who I was lucky enough to meet at a local Comic Con. Uh, after speaking with him for a while, you know, one thing led to another and he ended up choking me out. Uh, that's neither here nor there, but he was a very nice person for the most part. I am completely kidding. He was an amazing person the entire time that I talked to him. He was actually giving a self-defense demonstration, which was awesome. And uh, he allowed me to be the person that he demonstrated some of his, uh, I guess, self-defense tactics on. Um, I think uh, we'll put some pictures up on the screen here. If you notice the entire time he is choking me out, I have the biggest smile on my face because I'm getting choked out by the original Red Ranger and Gold Ranger. So it was a great experience. We got a lot of photos with him. He's a great sport. He's a great person. Um, he signed my Red Ranger helmet here. Uh, I really wanted to get the Red uh, Ranger sword. However, that has skyrocketed in price astronomically and I can no longer afford it. But uh, the individual that I bought this from eBay uh, informed me that they have pallets of uh, the, the Gold Ranger Gold Staff um, still available. So I only paid $100 for this, which I believe is close to the MSRP, the original cost. So I'm very excited to have this. If you look on this side, it's got the Power Staff on here. 25th anniversary when this was still owned by Saban. Power Rangers now owned by Hasbro. So that's why Hasbro always has all the figures for Power Rangers. Um, but if you look on this side, it's got the gold Power Staff, Power Rangers, Saban's Power Rangers embossed over here. It has uh, kind of a uh, Power Rangers Zeo symbol over here, uh, golden Power Staff over here, the Legacy Collection with a 25th anniversary sticker. On this side, it's got the story of the gold ranger and over here it says uh gold power staff it's great packaging again over here if you stand it up you have the gold ranger there's the power staff and it's closed premium die cast parts lights and sound effects which they don't do die cast effects with hasbro which is kind of disappointing uh, i missed out on saba and uh the first die cast green ranger dragon dagger i got the newer dragon dagger which is plastic it's more show accurate but it is all plastic which kind of it loses some of that oomph you know some some of that heft to it like this morpher this is a die cast morpher and this this sucker feels heavy um it feels like you actually have something premium but the new morpher that they have it does come with a plastic stand um, and a display for all the coins, which is amazing. It's something I wish came with this, but it, it, and again, it looks more show accurate. It's lighter because it's all plastic. So although this is die cast, it's very shiny and not necessarily show accurate. The, the uh, Hasbro one is a little bit more show accurate. It's lighter, it's easy to cosplay with it, but you're missing some of that heft to it with die cast parts like i feel like this is going to last forever because of the die cast parts whereas something with plastic you drop it once and it's broken so let's go ahead and open up this power staff and see what we're looking at and guys here it is and this is holy cow hefty um the quality of this feels amazing uh it is there is a lot of plastic in here this is all plastic but these are where it's die cast up here. This is the die cast material. And this is awesome. There's a button back here to slide this down to go into attack mode. Um, yeah, so there's a, a little button right here. So you just press this and it slides back and it kind of locks into place. Press it back and it goes back up here. So I guess this is just holding it, being intimidating. But then when you gotta really knock some heads you push this button down so you can see here and it goes did it work oh and of course back here once it's open uh it takes two triple a's and then there is an on off switch but you can only get to it once you open it up like this so we'll turn it on whoop it's on so it says again i'm gonna 
look at the instruction booklet here. So it says for sound one, Oh, that's awesome. That's That's cool. I don't know how much of that we're going to be able to play just because of the music, but you can just push down on here and it'll have some different stuff. We'll turn off the lights and see if we can get kind of show how bright this is. We'll turn off this light too. All right, ready? That's pretty cool. And then we'll hold it down. And then it starts playing. We'll close it. Okay, that's really cool. So there's another button down here. Okay, so that's kind of like an attack. So if you're swinging and you got to hit someone. Oh, so it's got different, different noises if you hit that button. Oh, so when you raise and close this. That's pretty cool. So when you... So right above here, kind of where that button was on the back, on this side, this is not a button, but right above it, there's a button right here, and that's where you're getting the other noises. So when you move this from position to position, when you're pushing that back button, that's pretty cool. So I am loving this staff. I think this is really, really cool. This is gonna look great in the collection. I'm very happy to have it. If you guys want, check eBay for some really good prices on this before it skyrockets. The original Red Ranger Power Sword is so high up there, I can't even afford it anymore, in or out of packaging. So with this coming sealed, it was $100. And I think that was a steal for what this is probably going to be going for later on. So if you guys want, act now. Who knows what it's going to be, you know, price-wise later. So if you guys like this, hit that thumbs up. Um, hopefully we can play some of the music that you heard here. And I'm back, Kerm. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Back, Kerm, out.